Hey there, just want to show a video of this uh, fire pit I got on Amazon. Um, this is the black finish. All in all, it seems really well made. I have no complaints. Except for one thing, the listing said it takes natural gas and propane. That is not true. It only takes propane. I'm sure there's ki aftermarket kits you can use to convert it to natural gas, but they specifically said it will void my warranty if I convert it to natural gas. Which kind of sucks because the main reason I bought it is because I got a gas line under the deck and the listing said natural gas. And I didn't figure it out until after I had it all put together. So I figured instead of un just taking it all apart and shipping it back, just go ahead and keep it. But down here's a propane tank. Luckily I had one laying around. Uh, also, uh, they used FedEx to ship it here. I have had nothing but horrible luck with FedEx. Um, there was actual footprints on the box, like they walked over it in the truck. I mean, it could have been that way from the factory too, but I doubt it. Um, luckily, nothing was damaged except for the gas line going up to the top here. Um, it was kinked from a from there being weight not on it, but uh, I've been it back out. Seems to be working fine, no leaks. All in all, it's a good fire pit. I'm happy with it. This, this far out, you don't really feel any heat, but if you touch this inside metal, you will. And it's just a little warm, nothing too bad. This has been on for about 20 minutes now. And this is what the lid looks like. I usually wait at least an hour for this to cool down before I put that lid on. And uh, the cover that comes with it is flimsy garbage. So, if yours is going to be out in the weather, I'd look into getting a custom cover made. I, I know I am. I'm going to get one of those heavy duty, uh, something like that, made up. But, yeah, all in all, good fire pit. Really like it.